Hey guys, excuse me here. Today I will be making Ooblek. So, it's from, it's going to be from this to a this. I was just experimenting with it and it worked. So I'm going to get all my materials and everything and I'll be right back. So all you would need is some cornstarch, but I got it from my local store for for this whole box for two dollars and just some water that's it and it's optional food color i'm gonna use red to make sure to see if i can make pink oops i need a bowl and some water i'll be right back sorry i cannot get the high ankle my tripod does not want to be working which is why i got that so let me set it up let me see um i'll be right back to set this up correct there you go, I already got the angle, so I'm going to start off with one cup of cornstarch. The, the, on Google it says two cups of cornstarch, but I don't think I'm going to have enough for two cups. So, oh shoot, it gets very, very messy very, very quickly. Let me show you guys what I'm doing. It's very, very messy very, very quickly, so that's one thing that I will say. Oh god. Oh god. And then actually I'm going to add half a cup of... Let's add that in there. No mess, please. Okay, there you go. And I'm going to add half a cup of water. Okay, so I have my water over here. And I have... I got these utensils at the, at the 99 cent store. Because uh, the thing don't fit, but it's called pouring. Oh, I'm going to make a mess. For sure of that. Yeah, I'm already making a mess. Okay. There you go. Okay, not much of a mess, but okay. So then it says immediately add food coloring next, and I'm gonna add a little teeny tiny bit of red. I wish you guys could see this. Well, you are gonna be able to see this though. I'm gonna add three drops of red, and I'm gonna show you guys my mixing. My tripod doesn't wanna work today, so yeah. I think this is going to make red and not pink. Well, that's what we were going for. Okay, so I'm going to mix this up real quick and I'll be right back so I can show you guys what is happening here and, you know, it's very, I can't do this with one hand. So I'll be right back. Guys, I was able to set up the tripod, but I don't know if it's going to keep that for much, so if it falls, please don't get scared. So I got the perfect consistency. It's nice and perfect, I guess. It's not red. It's kind of pinkish, dark pink. So let's see. We're going to use the finger poke. I've never, like, you know, physically contacted it. Okay. Oh, my God. Kids, shut up. Are you ready? One, two, go. Oh, okay. So we're going to start off with a clean finger, and then let's see if cornstarch gets stuck to my clean finger. Um, I have the other batch, but the thing is, I did not finish that batch because my spoon broke, but it kind of worked, so watch this. Yeah, it's that. Yeah, but I think this one, since I did it exactly how it was on the on Google, <clears throat> it came out perfect. So I'm going to do a little bit more of a mixy mix because there's still some cornstarch on this side. So I'm going to try my best to get all of that cornstarch in contact with all of this water. But I highly doubt that's happening because I added more cornstarch because it was not working. And it was kind of like a fabrication. So I'm going to add a little bit of water, not so much to the mixture. Oof, I have a feeling I'm ruining this already. I don't know if I'm ruining this, but I just want that corner to go away. And if adding water works, then I am going to, yeah, there you go. See that? I think I just needed a little bit more water. At the end, we're going to end up mixing these two because oobleck mixing. Oh, my God. Oh, cool. There's still a little bit more cornstarch 
over here on the set. But I'm going to pick it up. I'm going to see the difference of the consistencies from the... Oh, why am I cleaning myself on the cushion only? When I got napkins from McDonald's. I just ate some McDonald's. Alright, so let me clean my hands. And we're going to try to pick up this mess. Alright. Get off of the spoon. Alright. Basically, when I was making this, I was attempting many, many times to grab it, but then it wouldn't work. So, we have to, the easiest way to go is, like, in one second in the water, it's going to work. So, <laughs> it's so scary. Oh, my God. It feels so weird, guys. Look, I made a ball. Oh, God, guys. You don't know how weird and uh, it feels. It feels so good when you have it in your hands. But then you notice, and you give yourself a notice that you just have whoop like all over your hands. And bravo, Straya, bravo. I'm gonna do the other hand. See that? All right. So let's try the other one. Either way, we're gonna end up whoop like mixing at the end. So but I'm just gonna grab it with the other one. Oh, this one worked a little bit more better because I don't know, just cause I think I kind of followed the rules better on this one because it said one cup with two cups of cornstarch one cup of water with two cups of cornstarch so math okay i need to i made i just made a mess guys uh i need to clean this up i'll be right back so i kind of needed another i kind of need another napkin but uh, i was about to say mcdonald's you only gave me one I got all those messy eaters me too so my before um wait I just needed to do some little quick thing. Okay, so we saw today that I kind of didn't mix the whole thing correctly. Let me check the bottom a little bit. Yeah, I felt like parts that were not mixed, but are. So let's just pretend to walk because I was watching Freaky Eaters Only Human. Check that out. So someone was addicted to cornstarch and they made oobleck and they were walking on it. So walk, 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 walk. Ooh, okay. I'm going to kind of dip my thing in water, my paper in water real quick. So then, you know, it's easier for me to, like, get the squirrel. Okay, ready? Walk, 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 walk. Ah, it doesn't get nothing stuck. But once it comes to the grabbing, you need to grab very quickly and then kind of Grab as much as you can. If you leave it for a while, it's gonna do that. But if you grab it in your hand like that, it's gonna, not gonna. So if you kind of play with it roughly, like punch it and all that. Okay, so uh, it's kind of messy. This is for all those parents who, who their kids have nothing to do and you have a store or like a freaking place where you go buy chips. Let's say, let's say you go buy chips a lot, and you, and you went to the store, all you have to do is go to that same store where you buy your chips and buy a big pack of mycena, which is oobleck, which is cornstarch, okay, Spanish. Okay, this is hard to wash off, but either ways, and just like make sure it dries a little bit. Okay, we're going to go back to grabbing as much as oobleck as we can, so I can show you how this works. A little bit but it's kind of not gonna work as okay I'm making a little tiny oobleck ball but then if okay you guys understand it's kind of like slime when you like put it in your hand you know and then you kind of let it drip down but this is way more stickier and probably way worse than oobleck and slime unless you under activated it then then you probably have a problem. Okay, so I'm going to try to get as much. It's because I don't know if mine is too liquidy. Because it doesn't want to have perfect consistency. As I was expecting. I guess I did my math wrong or something. Because I, if I go to grab it, it's going to turn. Even though I grab it and play with it with much force. It's going to turn very not like what I was expecting. So I'm going to go wash my hands and I'm going to see if I can fix this mess. Ugh, a lot of things going on in here. Oh God, I can't catch everything. All right, all right, all right, I get it, I'm going to do this. So then, you know, it's going to, it's 
control itself a little way more. Okay, I'll be right back. All right, guys. So yeah, so I just washed my hands. So yeah, okay. So I'm gonna add a little teeny tiny bit of cornstarch. I'm not gonna add too much because I do want to make some tomorrow when I come back from school if I get bored. So then I'm gonna get my spoon, my handy dandy spoon. Oh my god. Today my day is just not great. Comment down below if your day was not great either. Probably in school, huh? Or you're probably, yeah, you're probably in school. You're watching this. You're not in school, but you came back from school. Or you're about to go to school. You're watching this. You know, you're like, ooh, Ubalak. I didn't know this was back. Well, it's not. I just decided to make Ubalak because I was bored on a Sunday night. I was bored, so right now it's actually like 8 right now in the night. And I decided to make Google. Like, a lot of you are going to be like, should you maybe take a shower or something? I know, but I will take it later on, like at 8.30 or something. So, look at how the difference of adding more cornstarch is if I play with it like that. Watch this. Look at how better it is. You can't really tell, but it's way better than it was if I do it sideways. You can it's way better because it kind of grasps it as I want it to. Okay, oh no, it cleans my spoon. See, that's what I want my Ublick to be like. Now that people want it to be nice and liquidy. Look at that, see that, see that? Wow, literally nothing on my finger. So we're gonna try to grasp it. See, see, that's what I like about Ublick. See, I could finally do what I wanted to show you guys. A little ball of Ublick. I wanted to do a little ball of Ublick and then show you guys the liquefaction. So you guys tell me. Is this solid or is this a liquid, you know? Oobleg is just something that hasn't been discovered. So let me grasp big ball of oobleg and let me just kind of mold it up into a little ball shape so then I can show you guys the magic of oobleg. So I could do that, then liquid and then solid and then liquid. So it's basically how you play with it. If I were to go get a hammer right now, it would not get through. It would get a little bit dirty, but not all the way through. The thing is, I'm washing my hands smidge because this keeps... I don't know how to remove this without having to wash my hands. All I know is I do have to wash my hands. So I can't put it out of place. And today I'm wearing my favorite outfit, my favorite summer outfit, even though it's spring. But I'm wearing my favorite summer outfit. I know. It's good today was kind of a hot day. I was thinking. I wasn't thinking much. I was just on my electric scooter all day. It's those thirty-one dollar ones that you buy. It's that's not me. Okay, so I'm gonna get this off. I think a smart way is getting my cup of water that's like right next to me and just dumping. Well, not dumping. You know, putting my hands in there. Probably the best way. Just to show you guys how fast this comes off. Look at that. Nice. Still a little bit of it. Oh, okay. I just need to do that very quickly. Whew. My hands are saved. And no rublek. Alright. So I need to have one for cleaning up the mess. I need to have a little paper towel for cleaning up the mess. And a paper towel for cleaning my hands. For drying my hands. Alright, so we're going to go on for the blue one. Too much of the pink, huh? A lot of you guys are like, where's the blue? I know, me too. Ready? Oh, the blue one is just so mesmerizing. The thing is, it kind of separated on the side. Just can't see that. See, this is not my consistency. No, no, I'm not going to accept this from you, Ublet. Let's see the color of this water once I put this in there. Okay. No, it's still the same. It's still pink. Okay, so I'm going to add a little bit of cornstarch. Where cornstarch do this one? I like my consist con oh, so hard to consist constant con you know what I mean a little bit of thick so when I go to grasp it when I'm gonna play with it I could like you know have fun with it and actually be able to do them so thick trickle something words how I want it you know what I mean as if it was the pink one. So, see, see, I kind of like it, but I think I need to work on our starch. You can tell it's way liquidy than this one. And the one right next to me is going to add a little bit more. It's worth my $2 that I spent. It's worth it. $2 spent. $2 spent well. Even though you could be going on making your 
you know, food and all that with cornstarch. And I decided to make goo like, <laughs> Did you guys know my sin is used for those who are rosados? The people who don't clean well when they go pee pee and it stays on the sides and it's kind of a burn and itchy effect. Yeah, that's what my sin is used for in Mexico. That's why it's very known. Okay, yeah, this is perfect consistency. Even though I kind of think I need more water, but I don't want to add that dirty water. See, see, see that? See that? Okay, okay, I show you too much, too much, too much, too much. Too much, too much. Okay. okay, okay. Still kind of dirty. Very, very dirty. Not still. Okay, and then liquefaction. Oh, God. Guys, okay. So it doesn't want to come off now. Okay, off. Off the hands. Off the hands. I'm going to wash them. Off the hands. And then into the cup. Into the cup. Okay, there you go. Into the cup. All right. So I wonder what color this is going to be at the end. Comment down below if you think it's going to be a very ugly purple, or just purple, or just still pink, because it's kind of looking like both. Okay, I think I think now I went too overboard with the cornstarch. I need more of this purple water in it. Ugh, I'm going to ruin it. I'm so stupid, I added too much cornstarch. But you know what? You know, pink, you might not be my favorite one. It's kind of like, you know? It's so weird. Look at that. It's like okay. <laughs> you're my favorite one, you know, because you, you, you work. You know, you're not as messy. So I could do this and still not get as messy as the blue one. So perfect consistency. I think less water than half a cup and a little bit of more cornstarch. I don't know, but everything I do when I follow the rules. Never works, but when I don't follow the rules, it works fine, guys. So, I think next time I'm just gonna have to not follow the rules and do this myself. You know what I mean? Okay, okay. Come on, come on, come on. Thick ball, thick ball. Oh, I just hit you guys. Oh, I picked on the table. Okay, okay. One of my little good fake. Oh my god, I just love how that works. And it just liquefies itself. So, okay, let me kind of. Uh, wash, wash the hands, wash the hands. You guys might be saying you are making a mess today. Yeah, I don't know why you're doing this. You are not qualified for this. No, no, I'm not. I just like making messes. <sighs> Finally, I can show you. You know what? I can show you, but the end of the video. So stay tuned to see the mess I made. Uh, it's it's worth it if you like making messes. And having fun at the same time, but it's not worth it if you're a clean freak. Cause I'm not that, so I can make mess all I want. The thing is, it goes everywhere. So let me kind of, you know, it dries up. So you put that back in there, but then it's gonna look away. Ugh! I don't know what to do with this, guys. I could give it away to one of my schoolmates, but I don't think anybody wants Ublek. Or I could give it away to you guys. Okay, I'm gonna whack it with this. Okay, bad idea because I kind of forgot it still had a little bit of cornstarch in it. Should have used a different one. I'm not using another one. Okay, guys, so we're going to mix up the blue again because remember how I added more water and then I added more cornstarch and then I added more water? Well, yeah, let's kind of see what this does. But this is the last time I will be showing you that other one. This is the last time I'm going to be showing you pink. This is the last time I'm going to be showing you the blue. And then it's going to eat you guys alive. Okay, so comment down below. Ugh, so much cards over here. So much lava cards. I hate that. Okay, so I'm gonna play with this and show you guys. I'm just gonna grasp it. As you guys can see, I'm gonna let as much fall as I can because I don't want to either. I don't know any reaction to this. I don't know how this works. A lot of you guys, smarties, scientists, he's probably a kid in my class who's very smart, is going to know what's the chemical reaction to all of this. Um, just need to kind of like squeeze it. Like squeeze it very hard. Squeeze it very, very hard to make that perfect ball shape. And probably even take it off my hands. No, not take it off my hands. But yes, make a perfectly perfect, not perfect ball shape. Okay, okay. Perfect, perfect. All right. And then, okay, so I've been playing with this without you guys even. Like, all right. All right, guys. 
Was this worth? Yes, it's worth if you want to have fun, but play with this outside and don't, please don't use this in your dining table because I kind of mess. Yes, I know, I know. You better clean it up or else you're just big, fat, mantenida slob. Look at that. It feels so weird when it goes. I think the reaction, I don't know if I'm right because you could feel it when you grasp it. But when cornstarch is alone with no water, it's super duper soft. Because I can feel when it dries up in my hands. Because if I leave this dry in my hands for a little while, it's going to become like very hard, which is what cornstarch is, kind of. I'm not no scientific person, so I really don't know no reaction. Now my tripod is all dirty. Okay, but yeah, so I don't know the reaction to this. I just know that I don't know anything about this, just like slime. Don't come in asking me how is slime made because I'm not, I don't know that. But do ask me how babies are made. I'm just kidding. Don't. Please don't. I don't know how. I don't know what that is. Okay. Oh, yeah. Works pretty, pretty well. But it's pretty, pretty sticky. If you know what I freaking mean. It's so sticky and messy that. Oh, yeah. Okay, 21 minutes. I said I was going to stop like at 25. So I will stop. Well, I told myself, not you guys. Uh, okay, I need to wash my hands. Okay, real quick. Ooh, 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 ooh. Goodbye. Goodbye, Ublick. So, how many of you guys guessed it's going to stay pink and purple? Like, you know, those very ugly colors. Uh, I just messed them up. Okay. okay. So, comment down below the color before you. No, go on and looking at it, and you're like, oh, it's this color. No, I do not see it. Oh, should I just kind of dirty something over here? So, yeah, I kind of have a big old mess, and a lot of you guys are saying to yourself, why doesn't she just go to the sink and wash her hands? That water is probably cleaner than what she is using. Yes, okay. Here's the mess I have in the same guys. Oh, yes, for you guys don't like to see my face, don't you? Okay, so. No joke. No joke, this is all the mess I have on my table. A lot of food bombs, a lot of stuff. Look at this! So much mess, guys. Look, just look at it everywhere. Just so much mess. So yeah, so much mess. This is very, very messy, but I will clean this up. I swear to you guys. So the cup of water, since I use it again, is purple. If not, it would have stayed like a magenta pink. But now you guys are going to be eating inside the oobleck. Very Right. Ready, set. By the way, goodbye, guys. Oh, wait, okay. okay.